This is a really cool, really cool tunnel that they built. What uh, what can you tell me about it? Well, about the only thing I know, we're 40 feet underground. They opened in June. Okay. And we have certain speeds we have to adhere to, but it, everything is controlled by the driver. Nothing's automatic. Okay. And what are the speeds? 30 in this curve, 40 on this straightaway, and then uh, like 15 on the ramps, 10 on those at the stations. Okay. So we don't hit anybody. I love the lighting and the way that they've designed the, the walls. Yeah, it's a, uh, when it's just solid white, it's like boring. <laughs> when it changes colors, it's oh, super cool, super yeah, fun. Pretty so now, do you work for the Boring Company? I work for First Transit. Okay. And does everybody here work for the same company, First Transit? Some Boring and First First Transit. First Transit works out of the Boring Warehouse. Okay. That's where all these cars will go at the end of the night to get recharged. Ah. But they are two separate companies. Okay. Well, that's kind of cool. You know some fun, uh, some fun facts. Any other fun facts you're aware of? Not really. Okay. That's all right. Well, they, okay. Well, they're going to expand this right now. They're in the process of go tunneling toward Resort World. Oh, yes. And they've got 800 some feet dug already. Oh, cool. Which is probably putting them under Las Vegas Boulevard already. Yes. Yeah, and then they're planning on going to the airport, to the uh, Raider Stadium, the Allegiant Stadium, and downtown. In total, they said 29 miles of tunnel. Wow. Under, under Las Vegas. But I imagine when, by the time they do that, they'll probably have autonomous vehicles and won't, won't need drivers. Yeah. And there's a cutter head right there. Oh, wow. Oh, that is so cool. The other side of it to show you, though. Yeah, we'll have to look at the, uh, the other side. Right. Oh. oh, yeah. 